New glasses, who this? <laughs> oh, what's up, family? So it's another day. I am currently on my way to work. Come on, car. Um, currently on my way to work. It is a Sunday. And my new glasses finally 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 came in the mail oh. like it has been I feel like it's been a long time since I ordered them but then considering the fact that they came from overseas little did I know <laughs> they came from overseas it wasn't that bad of a wait time I was just impatient because I couldn't see nothing well, that's an exaggeration. Like, I could see with my other glasses, but that prescription was, like, two, three years old. And so, like, I could see enough, but everything was still pretty blurry. So. Why is everybody driving the speed limit today? Can y'all come on? So. New glasses finally came. Um, these ones I actually paid a little more for. Well, the lenses I paid a little more for because they um, are the transitions, but they called them something else. Like it was something fancy, they called it. And I paid a nice little fancy price for it too. Um, but I wanted them so like when I go out into the sunlight and the sun hits them, the shades darken so these are like are gonna act as my sunglasses as well because before I had to always get two separate pairs well three pairs I would get two regular glasses and then I would get a pair of sunglasses but I wouldn't like it would still look like I was wearing sunglasses but these I can just keep them on and those just be sunglasses when I'm outside and regular glasses when I'm inside so I don't look like I'm too cool for school like I would do when I would forget that I had my sunglasses on and then I would walk into a building and keep them on and people looking at me strange and I'm wondering why. So now I don't have those problems. So that is these glasses, but I'm actually gonna switch out of these because you know, I just feel like they feel a little fancy for work. You know, just a little, like they're real cute though, but they just seem a little fancy. So I'm gonna put on the other pair that I got but these are cute. I'm so excited for the summer. So excited. Like these are just lounge on the beach in your cute little bathing suit or your nice little sundress. Like just looking real cute. Love these. But I also had to pay extra for the frames. Oh darn it, I got oil sheen. I sprayed my hair with oil sheen because one, I felt like it didn't smell the greatest and so now my whole car smells like oil sheen but I also got some on my glasses oh goodness but I had to pay extra for these frames in addition to getting them to be transitions for the fact that the prescription that my eye doctor wrote me is so strong that they had to like I had to pay for them to shave it down or however it is for them to make the lenses thin that cost an arm and a leg so the frames were $20. The lenses, nowhere near that. Like I think my left eye is a negative four and a half or 4.5. And then my right eye, my left eye, no, right eye, there we go. My right eye he wrote to be stronger because of like the effects of my MS and how it's like attacks my eyes he made my right eye prescription stronger because my right eye is working extra hard to make up for what my left eye lacks so that is a 4.75 with like a negative negative 4.75 and then he wrote another number like what negative 1.75 like added together, I don't know. But this eye is doing double duty, so he made it extra strong. 
<sighs> but such is life when you're blind. But these are cute. So I'm gonna take these off and put on my other pair. Uh, these are my old glasses. Other glasses. It's about to not have a choice. And I didn't even remember another mask. Okay, so I just have to wear my mask from yesterday. Cool. Take these babies off. Definitely got to remember to clean them. Like, and it came with these nice little carrying bags and uh, the cloth to clean them. Here are my second pair. It's not the cloth that you need, Drea. That was definitely the case. All right. Bam. I feel like with these glasses, I feel like a, a librarian. Like what book would you like? <laughs> what are you into? Science fiction is to your left. Autobiographies are to your right. <laughs> but all right, let me get into this building. Deal with these people. <sighs> But yay, new glasses. And I can see, like, the world is so clear and crisp. So, it's my day off. No work today. Um, but I am going to take a walk around the block. You know, it's my little exercise. You know, you don't got to get too close to nobody. You don't have to get close to anybody. Let me talk with proper grammar. Steady correcting the kids' English, and here I am don't got to get close to nobody like oh so instead of going to the gym i just like do at home workouts um i really like trap cardio her page is the bomb like if you haven't checked her out you should definitely check her out because i normally do i found her page and i normally just do the workouts off of her channel because you know i feel like i'm at a party kind of i'm sweating and working out and i don't even really feel like it so, normally do her, I did her this morning, um, did her workout this morning, and now I'm just gonna, you know, go take a walk around the block. It's nice and hot outside, well not hot, but it's warm enough. So, yeah, before I have to go pick up the boys from school, I'm going to take a walk, and I actually have to do um, a, a drop off, because I've been letting the boys use my tablet, and it was actually my fault. Been letting them use my tablet. And so that is where I also run my Etsy business from is my tablet. So my kids are so rude. I can get a notification, a post, like if you know about how Etsy sales works when you make a sale, like it'll ding like a cash register, like the cash sign will happen. So my kids will hear that sound. They can hear a notification sound if they're on my phone and somebody calls me they will straight ignore it not tell me and continue to do whatever they were doing on my device so that is what happened apparently on the 6th i got an order and it is now due today and just out of the blue i was like let me check my etsy shop and like update some things on it and there it was an order due today so I also need to drop that off at the post office so that I can be done with that because I have never missed an order. I have never been overdue. I have never missed one like any of this. So I'm not going to start now. When I get back from my walk, I will be dropping that off at the post office before I go pick up the boys. But with all that being said, my husband gave me a recommendation of like what I should do to make my walk like more, um, not effective, but like give me more of a challenge since I'm not like jogging or anything and it's just a, a walk. He gave me like his, uh, it's this vest that he uses for work with like um, weights inside of it. So I'm gonna put that on. And I think the weights that are inside are like 10 pounds a piece. So it's an, extra 20 pounds that I'm adding. It's a plate in the front and a plate in the back. I'm going to put that on 
and you know put my little jacket over top of it and see how that goes like it's only a walk around the block I may do it twice if I have time and depending on how I'm feeling so let me put this vest on all right so let me take off my glasses because here it is right here all right oh my gosh All right, this isn't that bad. So, he was trying to show me how it worked. Oops. <laughs> Wait. Oh no, that was my fault. I wasn't supposed to unstrap that part. Un momento. All right, so this goes under here. Put you back in. Oh. Now I'm like choking myself. All right, and then I close that part. He was trying to show me how to do it before he left. You can tell I wasn't paying attention because I would have known that I don't do that part. But whatever. So then, there are clips. Where are the clips? I can't like really show it to you guys. But here we go. These little clips. I strap these on the side. Y'all, this is a whole lot just to go take a walk. Like a whole lot of extraness. <sighs> okay, so that part is on, and then this part. Is that going here? I really don't feel like strapping this again. <sighs> I think I did it wrong. All right, so I take the interior of this like so like that. And if this is not how it goes, listen, I don't know how often I'm gonna be wearing this thing because this is a lot. So now I don't clip anything on the sides. Whatever. I don't get how to do it. I should have been paying attention, but I wasn't. All right, so I got the thing on. Because now those are going to stick out. So I couldn't get it. I couldn't get the clips part. So this is kind of what it looks like. Um, I didn't do it right at all. But again, it's my own fault for not paying attention. So let me go take this walk. I'm gonna put on my jacket to cover it. I asked him would he get in trouble if like I was seen like out with his 
equipment stuff on, but apparently he like paid for this himself. So he doesn't think he'll get in trouble. Or that's what he said. He's not going to get in trouble because he paid for it himself. So it's not like I'm wearing army equipment and whatnot. But I'm going to put a jacket on over top of it so that I'm not just like out flaunting about in his stuff. So yay, let's go take a walk. Okay, here we are. I had to take the front plate out because I looked like I was up to no good when I put this jacket on over top of it, how much it like bulked out. Like, even now I still look like I should definitely be stopped and detained at the airport, but it's better than what it was with the front plate. Like it was just huge. Like the, my jacket would barely zip up. Don't mind the bleach stains over here. Theo calls himself cleaning up and he grabs the bleach spray bottle from underneath the sink to clean up with and he just had a spray in good time and my jacket caught the brunt of all of it. But got my headphones. Um, yeah, let's go walking. All right, so we have been walking for about, trying to check the time. I wanna say like five, maybe 10 minutes. So far, so good. I still feel like I look good and crazy, but nothing I can't handle. I am starting to get a little hot though with this jacket on. Uh, and it's kind of annoying to have to keep walking past everybody's trash cans and stuff because a lot of people don't bring them in. Trash day been over. But I would say I have about three, four more minutes before I'm back to our front door. And honestly with the weight doesn't feel like a big deal. It kind of feels like when we lived in Georgia at Fort Stewart and I had to walk Tom Tom to school. I used to carry Theo on my back since he was still a baby back then. But he was like one, maybe one and a half when we lived at Fort Stewart. So, I used to carry him through my back, on my back, as we walked Tom Tom to school. So it kind of feels like I'm doing that. But we are almost home. And I don't think I'm gonna be able to do it again because I don't want to be late picking the boys up from school. But the way my kids are set up, after they're done their homework, I'm sure if I ask them, if they wanted to do it with me, they would. So we may just do that. And we are rounding the corner. I need to get one of those, um, I used to have the Galaxy watch, but with us moving so much, I don't know what happened to it. <sighs> to be able to track my steps and calories and such. Almost to the car, and then we're gonna go pick up the boys. So we're at the boys' school, waiting for dismissal time. 
we left the house at 1.34 and we got back to the house at 1.52. So, it was a decent little walk. It wasn't, like I wasn't pouring and dripping sweat like I am after I finish a trap cardio workout, but it was a nice little walk. Oh, I still have this darn, um, let me turn the car off. I still have this vest on and I really want to take it off. Oof. Would help if I took my seatbelt off though. I need to buy a new steering wheel cover. All right. And it's off. Order is ready to go. Make sure you can't see her address. Order is ready to go. I went in the house and got that. Um, let me unclip this. Glass has got to come off again. I might have to get out to get this off because I don't think it's going to work. Ah. <laughs> oh. Whew, definitely should have just got out of the car. Oh wait, no wonder it's difficult. I forgot the Velcro belt thing part. Oh mercy. That was so extra and a lot for no reason. Let me clean these glasses off. And I just realized I still have to drop by back the house back at the house after I get the boys before I can take this package to the post office because guess who didn't bring her purse? This girl. So I have no license. I've already paid for shipping, so it's not like I need my card or anything. Goodness. <sighs> Vision, I can see again. All right, so I didn't feel like the walk today that we did was much of like an exercise. So I'm gonna try to multitask here, see how this goes. I'm making dinner. And I'm also, while I'm making dinner, going to be doing some exercises in the kitchen as I cook. Will this go well? I don't know. But we shall see. <laughs> We're going to figure it out together.
before I get like fully into this, I just tried that uh, TikTok thing, you know, the I was today years old thing where they put the pasta strainer on top and then turn the pot upside down and strain the noodles that way. I'm pissed because it actually worked. Like it actually worked. And you know how many years I've been doing it the other way where you dump the pasta out into the thing and then you into the strainer and then you have to dump everything back into the pot. I've been doing that for years. And you mean to tell me I was just supposed to sit it on top? Things should come with instructions. Like if they want us to know these things, it should come with instructions. Oh. 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 Oh.